15-inch vertical jump. Yeah, like... Like, for a guy in his 50s with a hip replacement, that's pretty fucking impressive. Dude, I'm in my 30s. Nothing has been replaced on my body at all, and I can't do any of that shit. <laughs> so, impressive? Fucking, it's goddamn near godly. I believe he is dead. Yeah. You know? So, yeah. I mean, I think you're right. I think Shane has to go over. I think it's going to be Wait, shenanigans it, as it, much. Oh, no. Like, you think the world title match is going to be busy. Yeah. This match is going to have a oh, parade of yeah. people. Yeah. Vince is taking a probably the most impressive bump of the night. I guarantee you, Vince. Is oh, taking Vince it. is taking a bump. Vince, oh, is, yes. Vince is bleeding because that's Vince. Vince yeah. is like, I gotta go out there and I gotta have the big. Yeah, because he's crazy. Because he's crazy. He's the owner of the company, and it's also a morale boost as and well. And it's probably Vince going, I'll jump off the top <laughs> of the hill. <laughs> no, Vince, Vince hey, you whoa. can't do <laughs> that. <laughs> Triple H is like trying to Vince seriously. <laughs> do you think Vince bleeds? No, no. You think he's someone's gonna, bleeding? Someone's bleeding. And it won't be... In the, I think Taker and Shane will, both. Yeah. I don't think anyone outside of the Put match Put it this will. way. If Shane is winning this match, you better believe Taker's bleeding. Oh, when, when Shane said, I'm going to drag whatever's left of my body to Raw the next oh, night... he it, will be broken. Yeah. He will be limping the hell to Raw. Because, um, yeah, I this, the, to build this story up and to promise that the Authority will now officially be out of power. Mm -hmm. We've had the Authority for, what, three years now? I don't think they're going to be out of power, because all I keep seeing is, like, rumors abound of all this promotional shit of a brand split, and I think that's going to be true. They'll just take SmackDown? I think that's what's going to happen. I think the Authority's going to take SmackDown. Well, we'll we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. We'll find out on Monday, basically. How fucked up is that, by the way? I mean... In a world where H don't work Tuesdays. Yeah. <laughs> He's going to have to work every Tuesday. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's going to be weird. Um, <coughs> excuse me. But yeah, the way they've, they've, yeah. Way they've built this match. He has to, but it's so And the whole up. Undertaker can't wrestle at WrestleMania again, that's an easy fix. Yeah. The next night on Raw, he can easily go, and as the sole owner of Raw, I'm I decree that, yes and blah, blah, that, blah. Yeah. Uh, that Undertaker will be able to wrestle WrestleMania whenever yeah. he wants to from now on forever and ever. Because he's, you know, he's fucking... Because now the I'm the boss. Yeah, and, and, you know, I got no issues with him even though he tried to kill me. Yeah. You know. So... Yeah, that is an easy fix. You're that's right. That's an easy fix. Yeah. Which, again, although... Like, I get why it's there. Yeah. It's to give the it's character gives him of a Undertaker yeah. motivation. Which, like I said beforehand, it should have been there from the beginning, but I don't think they thought about it. No. I think they they, about was, any of this. No. This was all... This was all seen in a, the pants shit. In a world where this whole card is patchwork, mm-hmm. this was the patchiest of Oh, work. yeah. Because you knew... Because, again, this, this was, was Vince... Cena. This was, yeah, this was Cena's role. And mm-hmm. this was Vince pulling uh, a feather at, or an arrow out of his quiver that I don't think he even knew was going to actually work. Mm-hmm. I think he called him at the zero hour and been like, Shane, Can you do it? I know you hate me because if you know the behind-the-scenes stuff of what went on... He got fucked. Mm-hmm. Um, so I think this was him going, I will give you $150,000 right now to do this. Because Is that how much he's being paid? One hundred fifty grand. yeah. That's it? I think there's probably more on the back end. Yeah. But initially it's one hundred fifty grand. Okay. So I think that's up front. Um, in a world where fucking, uh, what's his nuts, um, Mayweather mm-hmm. got like fucking almost a million. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He's getting a lot. Yeah. But yeah, this has to go in last because it does. Like it's we said, the, the most Roman, important part. The like the world title, and that's the is thing. Is not the world. Is not the company. You Put know? it this way: the bonus of the fact of putting this match at the end of the card, whatever the outcome, if you decide to have Taker go over or you decide to have Shane go over, there will be no booze at all. Yeah, I don't believe so. Because um, that is also, the safest match to do. Also, if you want to get Roman over, uh-huh. wouldn't it be smart? Yep. To have Roman be one of the people on Shane's side to help him? Mm-hmm. Yep. Because you know Triple H is coming out to help Taker. Yep. No, oh, yeah. This That's is the, his job yeah. on the line. Exactly. So, They're gonna, in like, a world where yeah. an already world champion, Roman Reigns, mm-hmm. is going to come out and... Bitch, fucking hammer the shit out of, out of Trips, who comes down to help uh, The Undertaker win, you know, and that's where the old man comes in afterward, because, like, you have... You have Trips come out to help the Undertaker. Undertaker probably probably doesn't... with Michaels. Yeah, probably with Sean. With, with Sean probably, and Taker looking at them going, "Get the fuck out of here!" Right? He's not going to accept their help, but they're going to do it anyway. Mm-hmm. And uh, then you just have you have Roman come out, beat the shit out of the two of them. Arguably with Dean. With Dean, definitely with mm-hmm. Dean. Come on, there's no arguably. If Dean can walk, Seth. Um, Seth Even would be as amazing. A, as a distraction, that would be amazing. Uh, yeah, there you go. There's the the smoke and mirrors, mm-hmm. or even the Rock. Or have the Rock come out. You know what I mean? And then, you know, they ta- they cancel each other out, and then you have the old man come down. 
he takes a bump because, well, Vince is stupid and he's going to take a bump because he, nobody told him he's 70. He's crazy. Yeah. And then, uh, yeah. Oh, this then, match will be busy as fuck. Oh, yeah. It um, has to be. And the image of a Roman Reigns with the set, with this Shane McMahon mm-hmm. next to him, like, yeah. this is my this is my show and this yeah, is my this champion. This is my champion. That can't hurt. You know what It'll I mean? It'll help. It'll help a little. <laughs> I mean, it can't hurt him. It'll help a little. You know what I mean? It'll it'll put the band-aid on the bullet wound. Yeah. It'll help for a second. It may not be permanent, but it'll help maybe for the end of the night, which yeah. is all they need to happen for WrestleMania, because WrestleMania is their biggest night. Don't kid yourself. It's the biggest night for everything their and entire year. And it's the biggest WrestleMania of all time. It is. I mean... Like, this is an anti Park mm-hmm. Jerry World. Yeah. Where the Dallas Cowboys play. Yep. And no, they and, do not have 100,000 people. They and, don't have the ability for that. Because no. they build a giant stage. They, No matter what that stadium holds, they can't fit. They took away enough seats that it's less than 100,000 anyway. Well, actually not true. No? Uh, because... The, the Dallas Cowboys get over 100,000 people. Yeah, but they don't have Sunday. the big giant fucking stage. That... No, but they have nobody on the floor. Oh, really? It's a football field. Oh, yeah, nobody right. sits on the football field. You're right. You're right. Fuck. And a football field is rather large. It is. <laughs> I don't know, man. So I, it's going to be. That whole football field now has a tiny ring in it with people surrounding well, it. The stage is big, yes. Yeah. You know what? We'll find out. On Tuesday or Wednesday, we'll get official. We'll get numbers. official numbers. Not it won't from be the WWE. hundred thousand. No, no, no. But if it'll it's be eighty, close. yeah, that's the most official people they've ever had in a building. Is it true? Because Pontiac only had what seventy five. I think so. Yeah, I think ooh no seventy five, seventy six. I think they had seventy seven actually. So or they was can... that kayfabe numbers? No, no, know. kayfabe numbers were ninety three. Oh, was it? Okay, yeah. No. yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, it might have been. Then it might have been seventy seven. So I feel like if we I read get that eighty thousand people packed in there, that'll the be the most official. Yeah. Number. Why would you ever want to be in the fucking nosebleeds of WrestleMania? It's, You're not seeing shit. You know what it is? It's the the moment, um, the moment of being well, there. Plus, you have big screens. That's it, true. It's not like you, you know. What, it's kind of funny because we look at it. I'm looking at that going. Why, why would you, you want to be mean? there? But we're going to a movie theater, and it's the same thing. We have people chanting and all that kind of crazy. And also, shit. why would you want to be in a nosebleeds in a football game? Yeah, you know that's I mean? true. Like, I wouldn't want to. Well, I wouldn't want to do that either. But you know what I mean? Those yeah. seats are there just to yeah. be just, just to be a part of it. You're there. Yeah. You know? It is kind of funny. Like, if you've never... Like, this is completely off topic, but if you've never been to a movie theater watching WWE, it's kind of like being there, because people get into it. It's weird. Yeah, it's not like you sit there and say no. nothing. Like, people are chanting and people cheering People are chanting and, and cheering, yeah. Roman like, Reigns will get booed oh, in the theater like he a will. motherfucker. There will be popcorn thrown at the screen when he wins. Yeah. Guaranteed. And we'll be the assholes in the back making fun of those people, because that's what we do. I'll be the one guy going in the back like, <laughs> Well, I could tell other stories about Fuck a friend of ours. You, Mark. The last time we were there, Jesus Christ. Well, we almost um, got into a fist fight. Yeah, we almost um, got into a fist fight because of a friend of ours. Um, <laughs> but yeah, that's it. Yeah. Um, so that's WrestleMania. I'm hoping. I mean, I just hope that it's good. It doesn't. I don't. I don't think it'll be great. No, but, but I, as long I just as don't it's want it to good. suck. <laughs> I can't. Like again, on paper, there's good there. It's just the extra segments that are gonna scare me. Because that can, in fact, break a good wrestling show. Yeah. Like if, if like last year's in... segments were great. Yes, you know, they were. The Rock and the Rock Ronda and Rousey, Rousey was and, great. The, and the the spectacle between um, the the fuck was ah fuck I lost my train of thought. And there was something either way it doesn't matter. Well, there was a whole legend yeah, thing with Daniel Bryan after yeah, he won, which was great. Um, that's wow. that's going to be the key. It was a year those ago, kind, folks. What do you want? From those me? kind of segments are going to yeah, be key, and that's that's what's really going to make or break the show because on paper all the wrestling is good. And like I said last year, mm-hmm. people were like, year. "This is going to suck. It's yeah. going to be worse. It's going to be horrible." And they great show. It. it was a great show. Like that was the thing. Like I mean, a lot of people afterward were just like, "Yeah, it was a good show, but the build up sucked." Well, fuck you guys. Seriously, who cares about the build up? It the doesn't good? matter. No. How many potholes are in the road? Yep. If as soon if you get to the destination mm-hmm. and it's everything and that much more, then, then what does it matter? It doesn't, and that's the thing. But I honestly, on paper, it looks good. It looks really good. Um, all of the matches booked have potential to be great. Mm-hmm. Um, there's not a bad match on the card. I think the weakest match is. They're on the pre-show. Yeah. All the week matches yeah. are on the pre-show. And the weakest one on the main show is the fucking Lawn versus the New Day, which will be good. Which will still be the New Day at yeah. WrestleMania. Exactly. And so, not on the pre-show. Last year was pre-show. Yeah. This year, and they weren't They weren't the New Day no, last year. No. They were this New, they're this there was, new Day There now. was New Day, yeah. but there was, there was not the Unicorns. And, and that's the, the thing. Like that, when, when, and when the... that's your weakest match on the card, you're looking pretty good. Yeah. You know I what I mean? I think so. Like, in that world, like, 
again, like you said, the the bad matches, the ones you don't really care about, are all on the pre pre show. And at the end of the day, at the yes. end of the day, mm-hmm. it's still WrestleMania. Like if you don't get a little bit of a good feeling at WrestleMania, you might in fact be dead inside. Like leading up, whatever. Yeah. But as soon as that, and now so and so presents yeah. WrestleMania. WrestleMania. And you don't feel a little... You yeah. Don't even, if you, you don't, don't pee a little... Yeah, <laughs> exactly. You know? If you're not just... If you're not excited, then you know what? Stop watching Like, wrestling. I remember last year, that mm-hmm. fucking opening video, yep. like, Hello Cool J hits play, and yep. then, like, WrestleMania, I'm like... You get that. You yeah, get you get goosebumps, that, and you oh, get the... Oh, WrestleMania! Yeah, yeah. Like, it, like I said before, when I was not watching wrestling every year, I would still watch WrestleMania, because even when WrestleMania sucks, it's still WrestleMania. Even before they get a chance to ruin it. When they say WrestleMania, like, and now, blah, 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 presents WrestleMania, you just, oh, it feels good. And I'm, I'm fucking excited as shit. I mean, first of all, we have two amazing shows, hopefully, to watch. We've got, we got Takeover, Takeover Dallas, which, seriously, I know we haven't talked about it, but seriously. What I don't want is people watching that show and going, oh, well, that's better than anything Mania's gonna, like, don't like, think don't like do that. do that. Just enjoy the fact that WWE is now gonna put on two fucking amazing shows with great wrestling. In the span of a weekend. In the span of a weekend. Like, if you, and if you're bitching about that, go fuck yourself. Um, but, just, oh, WrestleMania, dude. Yeah. Just wrestle fucking mania. That's it. That's all. <sighs> just let yourself just be a kid again and go watch WrestleMania. Don't think... Turn the just, brain off! Yeah. Just stop looking weekend. about how the fucking build-up was. When you were a kid, did you give a shit about the build-up? No. You wanted to see Hulk Hogan beat the crap out of somebody. You know, you look at it now and go, oh, well, that sucked. You know what? You didn't think so as a kid. You were cheering on your favorite guy and booing the guy you didn't like. Just go back to it for a Try. night. You'll enjoy your life. You'll just be happier. Yes. Just, <laughs> you, just, just, you won't sit there being, that was yeah. stupid, and just be all tense and yeah. get yourself you all You won't sit there and up. seethe and be like, why are they doing this for kids? Because it's for fucking children. <laughs> it's a dumbass little show where guys pretend to punch each other. That's stupid. <laughs> I love it to death. I've loved it my entire life, but it's And I'll stupid. always love it. Yes. Forever and ever. And always. Exactly. But, but it's stupid. So let's all so just, just make a relax. Yes. Turn off your brain. Turn Enjoy your WrestleMania brain. Yeah. 32. Or, no, it's not WrestleMania 32. They're not calling it that anymore. Vince, don't like numbers. You know, all you jaded wrestling fans, yep. to just... you, I say, have a Snickers. <laughs> <laughs> You're the not you sponsor. when you hungry. Yes. <laughs> Ooh, I gotta have me some Snickers at WrestleMania. Um, you know what they, I mean? You're works. not you when you're hungry. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> just, just have a snack, have a Snickers, life will be good. Just enjoy WrestleMania. Seriously, guys, just get over the build up. Who cares? If the if the show legitimately sucks, which I don't really which see how it's gonna year. happen, yeah. If the show sucks, if the show sucks, we'll rip go it apart. Ahead. Everybody yes. will rip it apart. Yes. Have fun. Absolutely. But we if will... the show is mwah, like then, last year, yeah. Then just shut up and enjoy the fact that you just got to see some three, the end of the four day, hours of great show. The yeah. last two WrestleManias yeah. have been fantastic. They have. Like, that's the thing. So why don't? Why doesn't anyone call that? Why doesn't anyone go, well, the last two WrestleManias have been really good? Because all you remember is the build. Because as you can tell from the amount of listeners we have, or lack thereof, um, being positive about stuff doesn't get you anywhere. Yeah. You have to be negative. So, you know. You know, what are you going to do? I mean... Why not light a candle instead of, you know... And, yeah. Just, instead just, of just wallowing in the darkness. Just but light a candle and, or, or instead of peeing on yourself. <laughs> I don't know if that analogy works, but that's what I'm going with. So there you go. Yep. That's our WrestleMania preview. Mm-hmm. We'll give you our WrestleMania review and we'll we see. Will. Yeah. We'll see. If it sucks, we'll let you know. Yeah. If we don't like it, we'll be the first ones to tell you that they dropped the ball we'll and everything. Well, we were wrong. Yeah. Oh, well. But... I don't I think just, it's happening. No. I think they've got it down again. Like... They've got enough good workers that they can pull this out of their ass. And don't get it wrong. That's what they're doing. Oh, if this WrestleMania is great, it's yeah. coming straight out of their ass. Yeah. And it's the talent, not the fucking writing. I'll yeah. tell you that much right It'll now. be all wrestlers. It'll be all wrestlers, not fucking, not the writing staff. Yeah. But you never know. And we don't know yet. But I'm optimistic because, so am I. again, I'm a kid at heart and it's WrestleMania. That's it. So, WrestleMania. I'm a happy, happy man when I see that logo pop up. That's all I'm saying. So, we'll see you next week. Mm-hmm. Well, Sunday. Yep. And then we'll let you know next week. Yep. But until then, mm-hmm. you were Steve. You were Justin. And that was FedCast. Time for the showcase of the Immortals. <laughs>